All right, so you're moving to the Port Gordon area and you're wanting to learn more about the neighborhood. Well, today I'm going to talk about a local growing neighborhood called Whispering Pines here in Evans, Georgia, coming up right now. So here we are pulling into Whispering Pines right off of William Few Parkway. We are northwest of Augusta and Fort Gordon. And you can see by the entrance here is a small park area. There are trees, swings. There's also some of the community mailboxes. We'll get a little bit of a better view of that on our way out of this phase. So we are in phase one right now, which is built around 2015, 2016. We're going to make another turn here, and you can see these are what they call the cottage-type homes. They are about 2,200 to 2,700 square feet. You can also see the size of the trees in this section and about how big the lots are. A lot of the homes kind of have a similar style, but there is some variety, which is nice. So as we keep going through these homes, let's talk about how long it takes to get places. So it's about 10 minutes to Walmart. 15 minutes to Target, 6 minutes to Publix, which is the close, closest grocery store, and just under about 30 minutes to get to Fort Gordon. Of course, that depends on the traffic. So we are going to make another turn here. Oh, there's a home for sale right there, actually. But as I was saying, we're going to turn here, and these are what they call the estate type of homes, which are the largest ones in Whispering Pines at about 3,000 square feet. So as you would expect, the lots are a little bit bigger here. Then as we enter this turn here, now we see the garden type of homes, which are the smallest at about 1,600 to 2,200 square feet. Still beautiful homes.
that sign there is showing an entrance to a walking trail which goes throughout the subdivision. And we are now in phase two, passing through more of the cottage type of homes. So you can kind of see how the different types of homes are mixed in throughout the phases. And then rounding the corner here, we're approaching the last type or size of homes, which are called the ridges. These are the second largest at about 2,700 square feet. So that's an overview of the four different types or sizes of homes that they have here in Whispering Pines. Now there are also three builders throughout the neighborhood. They are Oconee Capital, Plandwell, and South Georgia Homes. There is another trail entrance right over there. It's a little hard to see, but here is another park area with trees and a playground. All right, so let's go ahead and head back up to the main road and see some of the other phases. There's that first park over there that we had passed when we first entered the neighborhood. All right, here we go. So here we are approaching this beautiful pool. And there's a good amount of people there today enjoying the beautiful summer weather. There's also a picnic table area, just great amenities for the residents here. And here we're coming to the roundabout, beautiful entranceway. can see looks like they're still breaking ground on phase six over there let's take a quick look at phase three over here this has the main office here on the right which you'll be able to see on our way back out of this phase it does have a mix of different types of homes again
where you'll find the community garden, which is another neat amenity that the neighborhood has. Here's the main office, like I mentioned earlier. So let's go ahead and head back into the roundabout and let's look at some of the newest homes that they're still working on over in phase five. First, we have more of the estate homes, which again are the largest type of homes. So you can see that of course the trees in the front of the houses aren't quite as grown yet like in phase one. There's lots of homes that are under contract, some that are still in the process of being built. And then we're going to make a turn here through some of the garden homes. There's another small park area over here. And then we'll pass a few cottage section homes here before we get back to the main road. We are coming out a different way from phase five now. So we're right back where the pool is and we are back on the main road that goes through the neighborhood. All right, so there are six phases total, and once completed, there will be about 660 homes. They're still building the final phase. One thing we didn't quite get to cover yet are what schools Whispering Pines is zoned for. It is in Columbia County, which you'll often hear is recommended when it comes to schools. Specifically, Whispering Pines is zoned for Parkway Elementary, which according to greatschools.org, it's rated 7 out of 10. For middle school, Whispering Pines is zoned for Greenbrier, which is also rated 7 out of 10. And then lastly, it's zoned for Greenbrier High School, which is rated 8 out of 10. So you can see overall excellent schools, 
But I hope that was a helpful tour and gave you some useful information and a good feel for what the neighborhood has to offer. As always, if you have any real estate questions at all or want to see any specific homes or neighborhoods, please comment below. Call me, text me, or email me, and I will gladly shoot that for you. See you soon.